अनुद्वेग करम वाक्यम सत्यम प्रिय हितम चयत स्वाध्याय अभ्यसनम चैव वांगमयम तपोच्यते हेलो फ्रेंड्स फ्रेंड्स दिस इज दी फिफ्टींथ श्लोक ऑफ दी सेवेंटींथ चैप्टर ऑफ भगवद गीता एंड टुडे वी विल अंडरस्टैंड दिस श्लोक इन डिटेल सो लेट्स फर्स्ट गोर इट्स मीनिंग सो द श्लोक सेज अनुद्वेग करम वाक्यम विच मीन्स स्टेटमेंट्स विच गिव पीस सत्यम प्रिय हितम चयत विच मीन्स विच आर ट्रुथफुल pleasing and favorable swadhyaya abhyasanam chaiva which means also the practice of self study vangmayam tapuchyate which means is said to be the austerity of speech so in this shlok shri krishna describe the austerity of speech to be the statements which give peace which are truthful pleasing and favorable shri krishna further add that the practice of self study is also the austerity of speech so speech basically is a medium through which we communicate the ideas that we have and therefore it's a very important medium because it plays a very crucial role in terms of building our personality the way we communicate the ideas with others and ourselves shapes our pattern of thinking Uh, if we always think of positive ideas and if we communicate only positive ideas then our thinking also becomes positive and if we communicate negative ideas and always are communicating ne- negative ideas to ourselves and also to others then our personality also becomes negative so it, if we desire to cultivate a divine personality then practice of the austerity of speech is a must because uh, if we only speak the statements which give peace which are truthful which are pleasing and which are favorable then our personality will also become like that it will become peace giving it will become truthful it will become favorable to others so uh, many times people uh, do not have a good knowledge on uh, what is truthful and uh, what is favorable and basically in order to have an understanding of that we need to study scriptures and therefore shri krishna has said that uh, scriptures are also study of scriptures is also the austerity of speech so uh, to have an to have a personality which is favorable and which is pleasing and which is truthful we have to make an effort to make such statements and we also have to have a knowledge of what is truthful what is favorable and what is pleasing and therefore we also should have Uh, the we should should have this tendency of studying the scripture so that we can understand it and therefore uh, shri krishna is saying over here that study of scriptures is also the uh, the austerity of speech also we have to understand that in these scriptures the kind of language which has been used is also very pleasing it's also very nice and very you know poetic so when we study scriptures then our speaking also becomes like that very poetic and very nice so that also is a way of you know study of scriptures and self study uh, being playing a role in terms of being uh, uh, making your making your language very pleasing and helpful and uh, favorable so that's why the study of scriptures also plays a very important role in terms of the austerity of of uh, speak speech so that is what was the message of uh, this shlok i hope that i have explained this shlok well to you with that i'll close this video i'll see you in the next video take care